Hi guys, so it's Zora Babes 2008 and today I'm going to do my blusher collection for you. Um, it's not too many because I seem to only buy blushes when I need them um, and blushes last me quite a while so it's just going to be my blush collection. This was requested way back probably in July um, and I did record it before I went on holiday and I came back and forgot all about it and I think I must have deleted it so I will do it now. It was requested my blush and bronzer, I don't know if I've already said that. But I don't really own bronzers, um, because I don't seem to wear them really. So it's just my blushes. I only have about one, two, three, four, five, seven, eight. I have nine, which is an okay amount. So it won't be that long. Um, so I'll just get started. Um, I'll start with the natural collection ones. The first natural collection blusher I have is in Blushed Cheeks. No, it's not. It's called, it's the Natural Collection Blush Cheeks Blushes, and this one's in Sweet Cheeks. That makes it more. Um, and you can get these from Boots, and they are one ninety nine. dollars you can get three pieces of makeup for a fiver. I don't know if they still do that, so that's what the packaging looks like. I really like the packaging, and it's in Sweet Cheeks. And this is just a dark, ready, like a red pinky colour. I'm not going to do any swatches because it just takes too long and I don't want the video to be long. Too long but I have taken pictures of the colour so you can see it a bit more. I might do just swatches, like pictures of swatches if that's a bit easier. Yeah, so that's $1.99 from Boots. The next one I have is another natural collection one and this one's in Pink Cloud. Same packaging but this one's in Pink Cloud. Same price, $1.99. And the colour just looks like this. Really nice Barbie pink, like a really light pinky colour. And these last really well on your cheeks, I find. And I forgot to tell you what it says on the back. It just says long lasting colour for cheeks, fragrance free. Don't know why blushes would have fragrances, but you know, the next one I have is the e.l.f. Natural Radiance Blusher, and this is just from there. 99p range, Do they have a nine? is it 99p or is it 199 I can't remember. Um, and it just looks like this, and this is in the products I regret buying because I don't like it and it's really small, but I'll still show it because I still have it. And this is just a light pink colour. And this is in Innocence. Yep, so I've got that one. I won't spend too long on that one because I don't like it. The next blush I have is also by e.l.f., but this is from their Studio range, and it says e.l.f. blush on it. I really like the packaging to this one, I just think it looks really nice. And it's got like a little slot there so you can see the colour. And this is in Pink Passion, but I'm hoping you can see that, but you probably can't. Um, ignore the line that's at the top, it's because it was in the window, it left on my windowsill and then it got sunny. Um, so that's the colour. Really nice dark pink colour, absolutely love this. And then you have a little mirror really like that. So that's what the line's there for. So if you're wondering what that was. The next one I have is this Collection 2000 Blush in 04 Trouble. Also this was in the products I regret buying because I don't really like it. But I'll still show you and it's just this really shimmery pink colour. I don't really like it so I won't spend too long on it. Next two blushes are my MUA ones and I really do love the MUA blushes. The first one is the MUA blush in shade 2 and it just says MUA Makeup Academy blusher and these are £1 from Superdrug. I've got to say e.l.f. you can buy it online and you can get some e.l.f. products in TK Maxx and this is just in a pink colour and these are a bit shimmery. Most of the ones I've shown you have got a little bit of a shimmer. Yeah, so that's in shade 2. Next e.l.f. blush I have is in shade 4. This one's a bit more mucky because I have had this for absolutely ages. This is just a dark red colour. And as you can see I have hit the pan. So probably be repurchased in there. I did do a review on my blog of these two so I will link that down below. But I don't really use my blog anymore. But you can still check that out. And the final blush I have is the 17 Pure Finish Sheer, Sheer Minimal Blusher. And this is in this long bottle type, like long plastic thing because 
it comes with a brush and I really like this and I got this free from Boots because I had a voucher when you spent a certain amount so you just push this up and then you have the fluffy brush brush which is really good and you just shake it and then it comes out so yeah and that's in rows but you can open up this bit which is where the colour is but I have opened it and taken a picture I won't open it because it'll go everywhere and it's just in this dark ready pink colour so I think these are about 4 99 to buy or 3 99 something like that but you can get them from Boots and it just says pure and gentle minimal blusher for healthy natural glow super, she super sheer and light wearable formula sweep over cheeks with the built in brush for easy application and it really is an e easy application because you don't have to carry around a brush you just whip the lid off and you're there so that's that this blusher I do have is the Miss Sporty O blushed again and I purchased this from Poundland and you got an eyeshadow and this blusher for a pound obviously and it's as I said it's also blushed again don't know if you can still get this in the Miss Sporty range but and this one's in 006 flirtation it says oh blushed again blusher instantly glamorous and radiant cheeks for sexy look and this is just a light pink colour with a shimmer really nice Colour. really like that um, I'm not sure how much their blushes are if you buy them in store but for a pound I definitely recommend going to Poundland and picking up one of these so yeah so they are all of my um, blushes and I just keep them in this pink tray with my powders so I'm sorry to the person who did request this that has taken this long but here it is if you would like any other makeup collection videos I have done my big makeup collection but I might be redoing that maybe like next year like January but I will do like lipstick collection or something like that if you would like me to um, so just leave um, any ideas down below and I'll see you guys in my next video bye guys